Yo, what to do, set up hotties? It's me, your boy, Mariella here, and we're gonna be doing the short bow, okay? Um, this is a little bit easy. I mean, easy if you know long bow, but it can be a little tricky if you don't. But good news is if this is your first bow in general and you end up doing long bow, it's gonna be easy peasy sailing, okay? Um, and so, as I mentioned in my other videos, as far as tying is concerned, um, I am just going to tie from the bottom of my chair and not the middle. Make sure that when you are actually tying that you're doing it in the middle of your chair, but for this video, for educational purposes, we're just going to do the bottom, okay? And so, let's get into it. So, first things first is that you are going to want to have... If you have your satin sash, having the satin side face you and then your linen side face the chair, okay? And so this one, I'm gonna start by laying the sash in the back, okay? And making sure that you got your two sashes are even. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your left and cross it over your right, okay? It's gonna make a cross. Um, you don't have to necessarily worry about the crossing in the front because we're really more focused on what the back looks like. But towards the end of the video, I'll show you what the back looks like. Okay, so I'm just gonna scooch this a little more so I can show you. So now that we're here, we're gonna take our two sashes. So this is your left, this is your right. You're gonna go left over right and the sash is a little weird because it's not even in size so this will be a situation you might deal with when you're tying so we got our left over right this top one that's our left it's gonna go over and under and you're gonna tighten it and you want to make sure you have it tight um, if you watched my longbow video, you would know that towards this step, I started, uh, uh, oh my god, oh my god, I'm sorry, that was my damn dog. But anyway, if you already watched my longbow video, you would know that I already, in towards this step, I tuck in my seams here so that my middle's smooth, but for this tie in particular, I don't really do that just because it's smaller and i don't really have a lot of sash to work with but you can if you want to sometimes i do but just for this video i won't so anyway you're gonna take your top and you're gonna make sure you have it tight against the chair okay and then your bottom sash what you're gonna do is you're gonna make a small loop and what you're gonna do is kind of grab it and pinch it with your left hand Okay, and then with your right hand, you're going to start by wrapping it around the loop and making another loop midway. And then this loop is going to go between your hand and the sash. There's going to be a hole. So that's why you're pinching it, I guess, if you don't know kind of where to go. So you just pretty much go in and you tighten it. And so now... Kind of gently because you don't have a lot of tails to work with at this point. You're going to want to go in and kind of start to fluff out your bow the best you can. This one I just have a janky ass sash so I don't have a lot to work with. But some of the sashes fluffing out is easy. Some of them like this one is a little harder. So it should look something like this okay this one fucking sucks ass god damn but anyway she looks something like this with the bow if i had a better bow or sash i could probably give you something better to work with um so yeah so it's gonna look like this unfortunately you might have to tuck your tails in with the bow and it's pretty easy usually any leftover bits you want to make sure that you tuck them in because they're just 
leftover bits and that's kind of the whole point of the short bow having it be short so what you're gonna do usually what i do is i take this and i tuck it in here somewhere like this so that's how i can tuck it in um i know sometimes people tuck it in within the bow you don't have to if you don't want to but look at this look at this fat ass look at this fat ass oh anyway but yeah so this is what it should look like and let me show you the front really quick okay so as you can see here i don't think this chair is the best example to show the front but this is the front so this is it's just pretty much meant to like kind of cross in the front um so yeah and you don't have to really worry too hard about what the front looks like i guess you know you just want to make sure that your bow is you know it looks good and that you have your sides down all right so that was a long bow i mean short bow see ya see you bye cleo fuck you fuck you fuck you ah! Ah!